Here with Sharding starting shortstop Addison Russell. Addison, how does it feel to be with the Xero de Moncola squad uh, for a second year? Um, I know you played over in Korea a few years ago. What is your adaptation to international baseball? Uh, it's just the fact that I get to see different types of pitching, different leagues, uh, see what they have to offer, uh, the uniqueness of each different country, you know, so uh, it's been it's been a pleasure, it's been a great experience. So and who are your favorite teammates um, from the last even season or even this current season? Uh, you know, we got a couple of good guys coming back, we got Chris Carter, uh, new additions, uh, Josh Reddick, uh, Panda, um, some of the coaching staff from last year is coming back as well, uh, new manager, Nikki, uh, seems like a great manager as well, um, you know, but the new guys are just embraced, we're just embracing them and you know they're uh, they're uh, be, they're being vulnerable for you know this uh, new uh, this new uh, I guess atmosphere and um, and uh, we look forward to playing with those guys and uh, you know winning a lot of ball games. And what were your highlights of you from last year? I understand like Xero's had a little bit of a short end playoff stand, and in the final was the onus that you could tan and towards the Tijuana. What is it going to be like facing those type of teams down the stretch of the season? Uh, you know, the good thing is we have a lot of experienced guys on this team, you know, guys that have won multiple World Series rings that are on this team, myself included. Um, you know, uh, just going down far, farther than a stretch, you know, hopefully we won't have to worry about COVID. We had a couple guys miss a couple weeks uh, during, um, you know, the dog days of the season. Um, uh, hopefully that's not going to be the issue this year. But uh, other than that, you know, these guys know how to prepare each day. Uh, they know their bodies and, uh, and uh, you know, we expect to have a great season. You know, we want to be the uh, 2022 champions of this year. Awesome. And what were your experiences this past winter with the Nair Nairn Garros and Herbert Seals? And how did you feel with still being in Mexico and, and pretty much facing the similar talent that is with the LMB circuit? Yeah, well, uh, it was my first winter, uh, so I just want to get my toes wet a little bit. Um, Herbert Seals is a great city. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a great organization, great ball club. Um, uh, I enjoyed myself over there, and uh, winter in, in Mexico is, you know, uh, play, playing baseball there is like the big leagues to them, you know, so every pitch is, is amplified, every out's amplified, um, you know, it definitely definitely has like that playoff atmosphere every single game. Awesome, awesome, and um, from this time out in Mexico also, obviously, um, here's another crazy end question. What is your favorite type of food since you've been in Mexico? Are you a tacos guy? Yeah. Or are you enchiladas guy? <laughs> or like, what else do you? Uh, I say for lunch or dinner, you know, tacos, tacos are my go-to. Um, but in uh, breakfast, the chilaquilas is, is muy bueno. Yeah, yeah, it's very underrated. I've had chilaquilas before too. All right, well, my name is Matthew Talley with World Baseball Network here with starting shortstop Addison Russell.